enhance the town. You can be an X form instead of male or female. Mm -hmm. How's the church going to handle that? You can be an X form instead of male or female on your, on your identification birth certificates. You can be X meaning unassigned or whatever. I think the church is going to say what it's always said, that there's male and there's female. And no matter how I might see myself, my DNA says one or the other. If you're male, you have an X chromosome and a Y chromosome. If you are female, you have an X chromosome and an X chromosome. My hair, what little there is, has the same DNA as my skin, my eyes, the rest of my body. I can change the color of my hair, but that doesn't change the genetic sequence that makes my hair brown or whatever it is. I can put chemicals in my eyes, I can put contacts in to change the color of my eyes, but that doesn't change the DNA sequence that makes my eyes blue with yellow in the middle, because I have two colors. Don't get too close to see it, please. <laughs> I can be wearing shoes that are like three-inch soles to make myself taller. That doesn't change the genetic sequence that makes me the height that I am. When we get into these things, the church will always say, you are what God made you, regardless of how you view yourself. I can view myself as the emperor of the Americas, that doesn't make it true. I can believe in my heart of hearts that I am the emperor of the Americas. Doesn't mean that I am. And while we have to care for these individuals, we have to pray for these individuals, and we need to treat them with dignity and respect, that doesn't change how God sees them. And God doesn't make mistakes. <laughs>